Leeds in Yorkshire was the venue for the second World Championship Series race of 2022 and for the first time the event was a sprint rather than an Olympic distance race. World Olympic champion Flora Duffy and current series leader Georgia Taylor Brown were two favourites but a very deep field of 53 women dived into Waterloo Lake and not for the first time it was the French woman Cassandra Beaugrand who took the initiative. So many times we've seen her power in the water. A phenomenal runner also, sometimes just a bike that lets her down. She was out the lake in just over nine minutes. Flora Duffy, as you can see, centre screen was right there as well. Some of the big names pretty close to Bogon, including Colwell and Spivey. And the existing world champion, Flora Duffy, who had an excellent transition. Not so good for Bogrand. She mounted the bike before the line, which meant a 10-second penalty. And she was dropped from the leading quartet as well after Flora produced some brilliance. Ironically, Flora was then dropped herself, recently having recovered from COVID. Maybe that was one of the reasons. So it was Colwell and Spivey, the American showing a welcome return to form after injury, that came into T2 in glorious isolation. Coldwell with a better CV in terms of running and soon she managed to put five seconds into the American but in behind Beaugrand and Taylor Brown were gaining with every stride. After just one lap Beaugrand was able to glide past Colbert, an astonishing piece of running. She still had that penalty to serve near to the finish line it would be one of the longest 10 seconds of her career but such was the advantage that she'd established it wasn't a problem even when Georgia Taylor Brown came into view Bogart was away and gone and over the line in just over 59 minutes a brilliant display Taylor Brown consistency personified hardly ever has a bad race she came home for second and Brits in second and third as Coldwell confirmed the bronze medal. A real sprint on for the lesser places. Spivey just getting there. In fourth place ahead of Potter, Lindemann and Duffy. Thank you. Uh, yeah, to be fair, I can't believe it right now. Like, I was just like very focused on all my race. And I think after um, Yokohama, it was quite hard for me because I was in a good shape. And yeah, I wanted it so much, like I worked very hard and I just wanted it to, to pay, so like, I'm very happy uh, with my win today. So Taylor Brown extends her lead at the top of the rankings, Duffy stays second, Beth Potter up into third, who had that phenomenal arena games earlier in the season. Spivey now in the top five after that performance today, along with Lara Lindemann, Coldwell up into seventh. A little further down, Taylor Nib not in action in Leeds. Maya Kingma, last year's winner here, now 17th overall. Sophie Caldwell, third in Leeds for the second season running. Perfect build-up for her as well. She's been selected for the Commonwealth Games, which has been less than two months. Taylor Brown loves performing in front of her adoring home crowd here in Leeds. James Gold as well, trying to def dethrone Flora Duffy. But Hogan, too good for everyone. A second win in the World Championship circuit. 25 year old looking potentially a good outside bet for the Olympics on home soil in 2024. Drama yet again, guaranteed in Leeds. Battle resumes in Montreal in a couple of weeks.